Hello. It's good to see you. Today we are going to be stuffing stockings. These are for some elderly ladies at um, my father's daughter-in-law's church. And we have seven stockings to put together. They're all going to have the same items. So let's get started. I'm going to start by taking a stocking. We're going to do seven of these. I'm going to start with these red ones right here. And we're going to be placing eight different items in each stocking. And each one gets the same things. Now the way I like to do stockings when I fill them is that I start by placing the smaller items down here in the toe to make the best use of this space right down here. Because once you start putting in the larger items, sometimes it's difficult to get things down here to this section. So let's see what we can put in here. The first thing we have is some lotion, a little container of utterly smooth hand cream. And we have some Chap Ease lip balm, a pack of two. That will fit in there nicely. Then we have a little package of Acellas uh, chocolate covered cherries. These are the milk chocolate version. They also make dark chocolate. These are all milk chocolate. So I'm thinking these little things here would be great to put in the toe of the stocking. We'll take the cherries and I'm just going to sort of stick it way down here into the toe of the stocking like that. And then we're going to take the hand cream. Let's put that down in there too. And then we have the lip balm here from Chap Ease. I'm going to put that down in there. So that makes the best use of this little pocket of space right here. Now, other things that we have, we're going to take a pair of socks here. These are from Snugadoo, and we have them in a bunch of different colors and styles. <laughs> so it's going to be a nice mixture. Now I'm going to take the socks, and I'm going to make sure they're just laying flat. And then I'm just going to roll it like that and just make a little roll and then we will place that down in here into the stocking there. Now you don't want to press too hard because these are Dollar Tree stockings and I don't know how durable they are. We can take a little packet of tissues. Now I have enough to put two packets of tissues in five stockings. And the last two, unfortunately, will only have one. So we're going to take our two packets of tissues, place those down in there. I'm going to try to turn them a little bit to get the best fit there. Now the next item is the largest item, and normally I wait until the end but we still need to leave room for a hat. And I have hats and several, I have three different colors of hats. And everybody gets a hat. And then I also have a mask. Now these are thin, so they're easy to just kind of slide down in there after you get everything else in there. You don't have to really leave a lot of space for that. This is Hostess Mix, Fun Mix. This is a combination of all different types of little candies. We have uh, peppermint puffs, butterscotch discs, scar uh, starlight mints, little lozenges of different flavors, possibly cherry and lemon. Over 45 pieces of candy. So, we keep 
can't really fold it, so we're just going to have to put it in there as it is. Sometimes the best way to put stuff in is to kind of get it in there and then just turn it up like this. So you're just going to hold it like this and you give it a little shake. You just shake it a little bit and it helps to kind of settle everything in there. So we still have a hat. I'm going to take the hat. This is also from Snugadoo. It's a one size fits all stretchy hat. We're just going to fold it, tuck that down in there. item is a face mask. It is not an N95 mask, just so you know. So now this, we're just going to slide that down in there. So there we have it. We have eight items in here. We actually have nine if you consider the fact that we have two packets of tissues in here. So that is our first stocking. It's very exciting. And we're going to do it again. We have another little stocking here, same style. It's pretty red burlap on it. I'm going to take lip balm, hand lotion, and cherries. Those are going to go down here. And with the little items, I don't think it really matters what order you do them in. Just as long as you do them before you do the larger ones. Okay. You're also going to need two packets of tissues. Let's do two separate styles. So we have this one here that kind of has that white background, and then this one is more green. So we can do these two next. Like that. Now we need the candy. No, wait, actually, we need the socks. I almost forgot the socks. Look at that pretty pattern on here. And these are so soft. And they have the little the little dots on them to give you a little bit of extra grip if you just wear these and you don't have shoes on. It hopefully will keep you from slipping. So we're just gonna fold them or roll them. We're not really folding, we're just kind of rolling them into a little a little little ball kinda. <laughs> just a little roll. And then we're going to put that in there, down in the bag, or in the stocking. And now we need the candy. Right here. a little faster after you get your routine going. And we have this pretty Snugadoo hat. It's a nice color. And it's so soft. It's just like the socks. It's very soft. So I've just folded it in half long ways. And tuck that down in there. And take another mask. Put that in there. This is our third and final stocking of this type. So we just have this red burlap. Look at that pretty plaid up there. 
is just a little folded over a bit of fabric. The back is just red flannel. So we need the little items to go in the toe. We have our chocolate covered cherries, our hand cream. This time we have a three pack of Chap Ice lip balm. Buy two, get one free. A little bit of variety there. So again, we're going to open the stocking. I'm going to take your hand and just kind of fluff it out a little bit so you can get in there easier. I'm going to take the cherries, put those down in there, and the Utterly Smooth hand cream, and the Chap Ice. Very nice. You can never have <laughs> too much lip balm, especially in the winter. And again, we're going to take two packets of tissues. These are great for putting in your purse or in your car or just wherever. And I just noticed they have a perforated place on the back that you can pull this open. It's a little sticker. You pull it open and it becomes like a little dispenser for your tissues and then you can just pull out one at a time. <laughs> Very nice. So in they go. And this time we have some blue striped socks from Snugadoo. They all have the little dots on the bottom. They're rubber and they give a little extra grip. We're just going to roll them up. And I'm not doing, I'm not putting anything on them to hold it together. I'm basically just rolling it up enough to go in there and have stuff on top of it. Like that. Okay. Ooh, it stands up. <laughs> now it's time for the bag of candy. forget the hat. We just fold it this way. Tuck that down in there. And a mask. I think this is the last one of this particular type and this pattern to it. was the only plush stocking that they had. They had sold all the rest. Look how pretty that is. It's so velvety. <laughs> it's very nice. So we're going to put the same things in here that we put in the other three. It's basically the same size. So we're going to have our little container of hand cream, utterly smooth. And our container of salads, chocolate covered cherries. These are so good if you've never tried them. Um, I'm not a big fan of chocolate covered cherries, and even I like these. They're, they're pretty good. And then we have a two pack here of Chappie's Lip Balm, medicated. So now these items are going to go down into the toe of this red plush stocking. We'll start with the cherries. And again, with the little things, it doesn't really matter what order you do them in, as long as you make sure to get the uh, little things in here first before you put in the larger items for your stocking. Otherwise, you can end up with a wasted space down here that you just can't get anything down there. So here is the Utterly Smooth Hand Cream. 
and the Japanese lip balm. Lips down in there. And again, we're going to have the two little packets of tissues here that are going to go into the stocking. This is also a pair of blue striped socks from Snugadoo. We just want to line them up as best you can because they're attached up here. And I just start down at the toe and just kind of roll them like that. And you just hold it like this. It doesn't really do any good to squish it because it just <laughs> springs back up. Put that in there. And now the candy. Okay. A fun, fun mix. There's plenty of room left for a nice snuggly hat. Isn't that a beautiful color? I love that nice dark blue. It's so pretty. We're gonna fold that in half. Long ways. Put that in there. Like that. And then we have room for this cool blue mask. Everything is just blue in here. <laughs> I like that, that plaid. It's an interesting design. So, there we have stocking number four. This beautiful red plush. It's so soft. It's incredibly soft. And now the last three stockings that we have are this style. This is a nice, sort of a beige burlap. It's the same material as the red burlap. It's just not dyed red. We have this nice little snowflake right here. Okay, there. And we're going to do the same stuff. We're going to put the same things. So we need the little items that go here first. We have our little cellas, cherries, that we can put in there. So we have the Utterly Smooth hand cream there. And finally, we have a little two-pack here of Chappie's Lip Balm. This is the original right there. So we can put these items in first. We'll start with the cherries down in the toe. And I mean, it's a little see-through. I can kind of see them. <laughs> and then we're going to add the, the cream, the hand cream. And finally, we have the lip balm right there. And this is the last one uh, in which we could have two packets of the tissues. That will leave me with two, so we can do one each in the last two. So we're going to place the packets of tissues inside the stocking. Like that. And of course, next. We have the socks. We're back to this pretty plaid here. They're really pretty. Very soft. I like the fact that the little rubber dots match the color of the socks. That's really cute. So we're going to roll the socks up. These are, 
these are thicker. The, the pink and white ones are a little different somehow. So we're going to stick those down in there. Down in there. Now we have the candy next. Hostess Fun Mix. I just noticed there are butter and cream little candies in here too. I guess those are kind of like Werther's Originals, which uh, those are really good. really pretty dark blue hats. I'll fold that. Add that. I have another blue and white plaid mask. Right here. Everything for the fifth stocking. Look how full it is. Wow, that's a lot. Okay, this is our sixth stocking right here. Really nice. I think this this is I think this is my favorite. I really like this the colors and the pattern and everything. It's just cool. So we have our Utterly Smooth Hand Cream. This is a two ounce tube of cream and it's, it's really great, especially in the dry weather in the winter time. It's, it's wonderful. <clears throat> and for this one, we have a two pack of the Medicated Chap Ease Lip Balm that promises to protect, soothe, and moisturize your lips. Is good. And we have the little packet of Cellus chocolate covered cherries. There are three chocolate covered cherries in this little carton right here. It's just enough to enjoy a little treat. So we'll start with the cherries. cream from Utterly Smooth. And the lip balm goes in. Now for this one, we have one packet of tissues. It's pretty green packaging. I'm not sure how many are in here. There are ten three ply tissues and they're full size. And then we'll take these socks. Oh, this is a pretty yellow. I really like it. It's so cheerful. And we're going to roll them up just to make them a little smaller. You don't have to. If you want to put them in their long ways, that's fine. Or you can fold them in half and put them in there that way. Whatever works for you is fine. There are no real rules to it. <laughs> so we'll put that down in there. And next is the bag of candy. Right here. Look at all these lovely little candies in here. We even have those little strawberry candies that I think everybody's grandma has. And I never knew where they came from, but I do now. <laughs> I'll put that in there. Yeah. And a hat. And you get little pieces of lint on here. I just try to make sure to take those off. And we're going to fold it in half lengthwise. Let me tuck that down in there. And this is my last um, ma mask with this particular pattern on it. So we're going to put that in there. There. 
there's our sixth stocking. <laughs> it's just so pretty. And here we have our final stocking. This is the seventh one. You can see the back is just felt. It's just slightly off-white felt. It's very soft and very smooth. So we're going to do this one the same way. My last container of Sella's cherries. And my last little tube of Utterly Smooth hand cream. It's also great for your feet. If your feet get dry, it's, this stuff is great. One thing I love about it is that it's not greasy at all. It doesn't leave that greasy feel on your skin. It's, it just absorbs. And then of course we have our lip balm. This is the Chap Ease original lip balm that also protects, soothes, and moisturizes. Very nice. We'll start with the cherries. It's just a cute little carton. And that goes down in the toe. Then the hand cream. And the lip balm. And my last little packet of pocket tissues. I'm going to put that in there. And I have these nice gray and white socks. The little dots are gray as well. We're going to roll them. So you start down here at the toe, and they're not attached down here, just up here. You start at the toe, and you just roll it up like that into a little bundle like that. And put that down in there. And then we have our last bag of the big bag of candy. I'm going to just put that in there. longer than the others. I'm going to fold it this way. Put that in there. And our last mask, this one has like a gingham print to it. It's blue and white. And we're going to put that in there. seventh and final stocking. We got them all done. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed stuffing stockings with me. And I hope that you have a wonderful day. And I will see you again really soon.